Patricia, our child support patient from EM. She's here for a preliminary. Yes. Hello, I'm Jax Garcia, therapist and neuropsychologist here at Hudson and Mike. Thank you. Please have a seat. How are you today? I'm fine. Oh, that's good. That's good. I have the closing results from Dr. Rourke's office to give to you. All right, let's take a look at this and we'll see how we can schedule our conferences. But before you read it and get the wrong impression of me, I'd prefer you hear what I have to say first. Well, that's not protocol, but if you feel more comfortable, that's fine, proceed. Whenever you're ready. What do you think? What is it? What do you mean, what is it? I told you five times. And no, it's not a female body part. I don't remember. I don't know what it is. I, f I failed art in high school. I never pictured myself loving an idiot with no taste in art. Look, I love what you do. I just don't get it. Well, if you don't get it, then why are you with me? How can I be with you if you're not even with me? So he's your boyfriend? Yes, but I'm sorry, I'm not a relationship counselor. I'm the head there. No, I know, but just hear me out. You've been putting it off for a month already. They're literally 80 years old. <laughs> They're not that old. And I would love to meet your parents, but things always come up, like with James's art exhibit and client work. Art exhibit? It just sounds like you're making stuff up. I told you, James's thing with the shapes where I could showcase my work. Why are we even here? What do you mean? I like this place to see It's it. him, isn't it? You're just embarrassed to be seen with me, aren't you? <sighs> Can you take me home? So you are romantically involved with these two people? Yes, but the challenge wasn't if my love for them wasn't true. It was if I loved myself. Well, that's the biggest drawback. You're not only unfair to these two individuals, but you're unfair to yourself as well. Did you ever resolve your emotional situation between them? Yes, but before I did, there was one person I can talk to. My friend. Knock, knock. Hey, James. In the flesh. How's my favorite artist? I'm fantastic! My check for one of my paintings that was in your art exhibit just came in for 250 big ones. Ah, congratulations. I do hope you'll have the next set ready for the upcoming exhibit on the 16th. Already finished. I'm just finishing up some sketching. You know how much I like to portray the chaotic people around here? You know, some would deem it unfair to project these people under such sour light. Well, isn't that what art is all about? To portray the world around me? Speaking of your world, how are they? They're fine. Have you ever stuck your hand in a rose bush to try and pick the perfect rose, only to find that the one you want is out of reach? Well, you know, as I always say, each detail, however small, comes together to form the art you express. Without it, it's nothing. Like a blank canvas. I'm glad you could meet me here today. Hey. You came to me. I wanted to give you this. I can't seem to get rid of it. I created it when all this stuff between them and myself, and I couldn't find myself throw it away. I thought you should have it. Would you like for me to sell it anonymous? No, no. Keep it. I might want it back later.
I met with James today. Mm -hmm. I gave him the sketch. Oh, what did he say? Nothing, he... Expecting someone? No, are you? I'll be right back. Hey, uh, what you doing? Just doing some sketching. So, you wanna grab something to eat? Maybe, uh, pay me naked? <laughs> I just ate some leftovers, so... Uh, so, can I come in? Um, not tonight. I have a thing with the art exhibit tomorrow morning. You wanna grab some lunch afterwards? Yeah, of course. I'm sorry, please excuse me. Yes, Alex. Do you have a call from Dr. Rohr? He wishes to speak with you immediately. Could you tell him that I'll get back to him as soon as I can? Okay. Thank you. I do apologize for that. Please continue. Maybe I should go too. What's one more? What do you mean? What are you doing here? What are you talking about? You said you wanted to have lunch after your thing. But I told it to you. What are you doing? To whom? What are you talking about? Come on, idiot. Please pick up. Hey babe, I just got your call as soon as wait, you were pulling. Wait, wait, wait. Where were you today? I was at the restaurant and... Are you two pulling a prank on me? Are you two trying to mess with me right now? Because I wouldn't stand for it. With her? With who? What are you talking about? What? Talking about my parents? Did you finally meet them at the restaurant or something? I, I gotta go. Hey, where, where are you going? Hey, come on. Before, but I have to tell you again anyway. Can you tell me their names? Yes, their names. Their names were. Do you, do you their remember me? Can you tell me my name? What's my name? Mr. James. James Rourke. Dr. James Rourke. Yes. Okay, good. Now, this document states. You're schizophrenic. You were diagnosed just over three months ago, legally, but we're not sure how long you've had this condition. Those people you refer to, they don't exist. This is a sketch that you gave me of those two individuals. I'm sorry, but those people, they, they're not real. This time it would be wise to consider committing you. No, I want out of here. Transfer me. I want someone else to verify this for me. Patricia, we could transfer you again, but I really think it's time. No, do it. Do it anyway. Yes, may I speak to social services, please? the words that are on that paper. Why don't you come on Monday? Like nine o'clock. Okay, is 
that it for today? for a friend of ours. She's here, um, we don't know where to find her though. Yeah, she's, I think she's a patient. Yeah, if you go to that building, talk to the receptionist. Right? Yeah. 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 Please, I need to speak to the hip therapist, Dr. Janice Garcia, immediately. I'm sorry, she's a 